show. We don't. Uh uh. Come here. There we go. Charlie. Hi, Joe. It's nice to meet you. A monster right there. Fish. Fishing with Joe. You gotta love it, man. I can't wait to get back to more Fishing with Joe. Be sure to check out www.fishingwithjoe.com. Joe has brand new t-shirts, new show DVDs, and much more. Now, let's get back to the action.
I can't wait to get back to more fishing. But before we do, I wanted to take a chance to tell you about fishingwithjoe.com. He's got new t-shirts, guide services, and more. Now let's get back to the action. <laughs> no! 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 Oh gosh. Okay. Everybody at home, let's just let's pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> I'm just going to shake it off. Oh man. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah. Oh, wow, I'm just gonna shake it off. Pretend it didn't happen. You didn't even see that. <laughs> you didn't even see it. Oh wow. That was incredible. He blew up on that plug. Oh. Yes, come here. Oh, yeah. Don't, don't, no. <laughs> no, 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 don't come off. Don't, don't come off. <laughs> all right, all right. I got a net. I got a net for you. I got a net for you. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Get in that net. Get in that net. Oh, God, get in the net. <sighs> Heart attack city. Hello. Hard to, ah, all right, stay still. There he goes, he came unbuttoned. All right, there you go right there. Smallie on a top water plug. You saw me lose the last one, well, okay. I made up for it with that one right there. Excellent smallmouth. When they're on a top water when they're on the top water bite and they're just snarfing those top water plugs down. You gotta love that. You gotta love it. Look at that. That's a beautiful smallmouth bass. All right, Mr. Fish, I'm gonna let you go. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. All right. Yeah, now that was fun. That was fun. Got my heart beating. All right, I gotta get back out there. I gotta get back out there. I really, really wanna get back to fishing, but before we do, I have to tell you a little bit about this website, www.fishingwithjoe.com. On this website, you'll be able to find t-shirts and also a guide service and a ton more other stuff. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Are you ready for the action? Uh. Good God Almighty! Oh God! Pull and drag. Can I find a net in time? Uh-uh. Baby, come on. Whoa! Come on in the net. Oh. That's what I'm talking about right there. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about right there. Look at this, look at the size of that smallie. Just annihilated that top water plug. Ah, oh, my heart is beating a million miles an hour. Look at the size of that bass. You gotta love that. You gotta love it, man. Scioto River and the streams in the state of Ohio, the fishing is phenomenal in a lot of the streams in Ohio. 
and the fishing is really overlooked. A lot of the guys go to the lakes in the middle of the summer, in the heat of the summer. I'm catching big, big smallies like that. Oh, wow. All right, Mr. Fish, thank you very much. There we go. All right. Now we having fun. Now we having fun. Little one. He came back for it. I seen him come up, hit at the bait. He saw me, went down, then came back for it. Hold still. There we go. Get those hooks out of you. Yeah, I knew he was there the whole time. All right. One set of hooks, and then there's two. Another smallie on the top water. There we go, thank you. Catching all species today. It's an all species alert on fishing with Joe. All right, there goes a toothy critter, a saw guy, a Scioto River. Let me get this hook out here. Side of the river. I don't want to stick my finger in his mouth. All right, let's go back. Thank you. All right, next fish. Ever wish you were hooking up like Joe? Joe's fishing guide service has got you covered. Joe knows where to go and what to do. He is definitely using the right bait. Just sign on to fishingwithjoe.com to get hooked up on your trip today. Ah, there we go. Hit it as soon as I threw it out there. There we go. Whoa. All right, they're getting bigger. They're getting bigger. Get the hooks out of this one. All right, now I'm starting to pick up a distinctive pattern. Of course, they're smallmouth and they're gonna be around rocks, but every time I hit a, a set of good rocks, I seem to catch another one. So there goes another one right there. I'm gonna throw him back. Thank you, Mr. Fish. And now I'm gonna pay more attention to the rocks. And not just any rock, but pronounced, pronounced rocks. <laughs> when you're out fishing, you gotta be ready for anything. <laughs> I do wish it would have fell back there, cause I, I, I believe I could have caught a fish out of that spot right there. <laughs> it wouldn't have fallen in.
It reminds me of that old saying, if a tree falls in the forest and no one is around, does it make a sound? Oh, there we went, another hit. It's a good sign right in front of us. A heron. Whenever I see the herons, I know this much. I, ooh, here we go, <laughs> yes. Come on in the boat. Like I said, whenever I see the heron, I know this much. The heron is eating probably the very same thing that the smallmouth bass would be eating. Small fish. And so I am, when I see that heron, I'm, I suddenly am more confident that I'm in an area where there's some bait at. All right? I tell you, when these fish grab these topwater plugs, they really, really get them. Look at that. All right. Another smallie. They're hitting the Yozuri walking dog. If you can find them, you better get them. Excellent, excellent bait. There you go. Going home. Thank you. All right. Do you want even more fish with Joe? You've got it, and you can have it anytime you want. Days, nights, weekends, and holidays. 24-7, 365. Joe's has over 50 exciting episodes, new and old, online. Just log on to fishingwithjoe.com to check out all the shows. Fish. Ugh, goodness gracious! Look at the size of that one! Oh yeah! Oh, wow. Oh, not a spot, largemouth. Didn't expect him to be in this spot. Didn't expect him to be here. Look at the size of that largemouth. Wow. On the lower Scioto, we're catching spots so far. Largemouth, they're on the jig bite. I'm tearing them up. Gotta love that. You gotta love it, man. Look at size of that fish. Whoa, he's ready to go back. Excellent fish, excellent fish. Just flipping this jig out into these brush piles and these log jams. These log jams are full of fish on the lower Scioto. Excellent fish. All right, Mr. Fish, there you go. Thank you. All right, there we go. All right, we're having fun now. I gotta get back out there and catch another one. Oh, yeah. Gotta get back out there and catch another one. Oh, yeah. What happens a lot of times is the smaller fish will position the, themselves at the bottom of the brush pile or a log jam down at the end. And the larger fish will take the best spots. And those old fish, ooh, ooh, there we go. Come here. There we go. There we go. It's another one. Come here. Oh, yeah. Like I was saying, the smaller fish will position themselves on the bottom of the brush pile. That's actually because they're getting pushed to the bottom of the brush pile. The larger fish will push their way to the top of the brush pile. So that way when the food comes downstream, 
the larger fish, they're in a position to feed first. Nice Kentucky spotted bass. I'm in a lower sciota. There's tons of them. Uh, you can tell the difference between those and a largemouth by the lateral, by the streak on the lateral line here. And also, there's a tooth patch on the tongue of the fish. And if you stick your finger in his mouth, rub it right along his tongue, you can feel that tooth patch. Thank you, Mr. Fish. All right. All right, now we're gonna go back to work, catching some more. We are having fun. We're having fun. Ooh, fish, hit. Oh, that's a good one. Another good fish, another good one. Look at that. Nice. Wow, came right off. Nice spotted bass. There goes another one on the lower sciota. Hooking up on Kentucky spotted bass. You gotta love it. You have gotta love it. Aggressive little fish. As soon as I threw that bait out there, it twisted about three times. Bow. He hammered it. All right. Thank you, Mr. Fish. Thank you. Thank you. All right. It was a good one. All right. They are on the jig bite today. I am tearing them up. What? He had it. Fish. <laughs> wow. I don't know what this is. Oh, there he goes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He hit it a couple times before he got it. But he got it. Tearing him up. Ooh. Oh, drop my fish. Come on, fish. There we go. Another Kentucky spotted bass on the lower Sciota. We're tearing them up, tearing them up, fish after fish. Wow. Thank you, Mr. Fish. Thank you very much. I'm spokesmodel Katie Wagonrod, and thanks for watching the show. Be sure to tune in next week for another exciting episode of Fishing with Joe.